A cracked helmet is serving as a critical reminder to families everywhere tonight on the importance of bicycle safety. As one Becker County family says, without that helmet, their three-year-old daughter would be suffering from more than just a few cuts and bruises after being hit by a car last week. Valley News Team's crime and safety reporter Bailey Hurley spoke with the family today and has our story. That would have been her head had it not been the helmet. A bike ride back home turned into a race last Thursday for three year old twins Vanessa and Betty and their cousin pedaling the pavement as fast as they could down First Avenue in small town Callaway, Minnesota. We have a strict no helmet, no bike ride policy and England says that turned out to be a blessing as the thrill of winning that race overrode Betty's good safety habits. He's yelling for Betty to stop, but she's so excited about winning the race that she didn't hear him in time to stop at the stop sign, so it ended up a little bit in the road, and that was just the perfect moment that a, that a car was right there. While the car was following the speed limit, driving between 20 and 30 miles an hour, it was still enough to knock Betty off her bike and wrecked her beloved Paw Patrol ride. But doctors told the family it could have been so She's much worse if it wasn't moves. for that unicorn uh -huh. helmet. We likely wouldn't have taken her home and it probably would have been permanent brain damage, which would make sense because that's a pretty vital part of your skull and for being so little. Which is why England says she's sharing her daughter's story tonight, urging parents across the valley to ensure your kids not only have a helmet, but that they always wear it. Get helmets on your kids. They might not want to wear them. None of us do, but even if a kid falls and hits their head on a curb, that could be devastating. Dad, dad. In Callaway, Bailey Hurley. Valley News Live. And England says while Betty is a bit more timid when on the street, the incident hasn't ruined a riding a bike or scooter for her. She says Sunday marks the twins' birthday, which might mean a replacement bicycle is already on the way. Shh, with hopefully <laughs> some good weather to go along with it.